One eternity later. Twenty hours on the dot. Damn. Oh shit. Oh. oh. God damn. <laughs> Alright, I gotta let it cool down a little bit. Now I'm gonna take everything on this pedal. There's a bunch of like, you've seen it all, like the plastic supports and stuff hanging off. Um, take a pair of your like cutters that usually come with the printer and cut everything and try to clean it out as best you can and then get it separated from the glass plate on the bottom. Oh, Christ, that was stressful. Honestly, I put this step in here extra because, I don't know, I'm just extra. I'm using a blowtorch here, a little mini guy, to clean up the edges and stuff. When you, like, scratch it, you end up with, like, that white, um, I don't know, whatever it looks like. So I just take a blowtorch to it after I scrape all the edges. I'm just being a perfectionist at this point, just trying to make it look as clean as possible. So using a little, looks like a dental pick, but it's actually an AR-15 cleaning tool. Use that, hit it with the torch a little bit, smooth it out, makes it look nice, I don't know. It's a little extra, you don't have to do this, but I'm just going oh, yeah. OCD over here. Oh shit, that's nice, that's nice. Oh, that's looking pretty, oh that's pretty. All right, let's add the bearings. I guess uh, the shells, whatever the fuck you wanna call them. Let me find something that fits this. Oh, too big. Mm -hmm. Yep, nine millimeter socket. And on the back side here. <laughs> oh, that's pretty. All right, that one's pressed in. Let's do the other side. Okay. That's the back side. Where's the other bearing? There it is, the smaller one. Oh boy, this one's snug. Oh no. Fuck. Yeah, when it doubt, pound it out, right? Yeah, yeah, just smash the fuck out of it. Let me find another fucking. This one is way bigger. All right, it's too big. Damn it. I got a better punch. There we go. All right. That is cool. All right, that is the outside of the crank arm. That's the smaller guy. That's the bigger guy. Your obviously crank arm sits here. That's a close one. So it sits like this. This is a left pedal. This is my dominant um, pedal grind side. So, or crank arm side, whatever. All right, now the miserable part, putting all those tiny little bearings in here. All right, we're gonna do this this way. Take one of these out. My old pedal, look at that. All but one came out of my old pedals. Two, two didn't come out. How many are there? There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen tiny fucking ball bearings in there. Fourteen. So let's uh Jesus Christ, I got shit everywhere. I'm like, Man. take this. Give me a fucking glob of grease there. Fucking Try not to shake that shit too much. I can put some back here. Boom. Fucking pray they all just fucking stay on and we can kind of rotate that into place. Oh, dude. Minus that fucking stupid rubber thing. 
which I didn't compensate for because, I don't know, I just didn't fucking think of the fucking rubber thing. Does it matter? It fits. I mean, it's rubber, so it's got a little bit of flex to it. Ah, oh, dude. There we go. There's that. Now we got to get the inside ones. Oh, Christ. So there's 14 on the back. And there are... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Fuck twelve on the fucking on this side. I have other ball bearings here, but I want to use these ones. Why? I don't know. I just do. I want to make sure I have twelve. Make sure they're exactly the same rather than picking through like you know all those that I have from other pedals and spindles and shit. The whole time I'm having to hold this spindle in and I hate it. Alright, another glob of fucking grease here. Alright, put that shit down that shaft. Break that shit off my fingers. Let's count these again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Indeed, 12 fucking unbelievably small, loose ball bearings. Let's put all these bad boys in here. Boom. Just like that. Fucking, oh god, this actually might be the worst part. Putting these all down there in order. If there is an order, I don't know, just, you know, get them around that damn thing in place. The grease is actually making it way more challenging, things sticking on top of each other. So, you know what? Kind of like I did on the back side. Let's do the same thing here. Let's take our conical or fucking bearing, fuck, dang there. Oh, God. We're gonna fucking put it right on the back. Oh Christ, Let's see if we can fucking... <laughs> see if I can rotate this thing in with this fucking little all. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Slow and steady. Slow and steady there. Oh, there's one fucker that just didn't go in. Oh, oh, you bitch. You, you get in there. You go with your friends. Okay. All right. I think that is all unbelievably small ball bearings in there. Oh, dude, that is so fucking sick. Okay. Boom. Oh shit, there's little fuckers on here from other pedals. Get off! Where's my 9 mil at, dude? Fucking little dirt there. Alright. Alright, what the fuck am I doing? Why am I. Wah! There's too much grease in here, dude. It's a good thing and a bad thing. It's a good thing. Alright. Oh, dude. A little rough. I got to back pedal the inside one out a bit. Just try to get it right, you know? Get it right, get it tight. There we go. Oh, that's way too tight. Nope, nope. No bueno. No bueno. A few moments later. That is fucking remarkable. Loose ball bearings, everything even fit a little rubber seal on the back. This is the uh, this is my version two. I added the uh, concave better, raised the platform by one mil rather than or the platform whatever the us them. These are also six mil thick, 
Uh, the bottom is seven and a half. Diamond plate bottom. This is 10 mil thick. Six mil, six mil. Oh, dude. I'm gonna uh, go get on the CAD program and make myself a little cap for the end of it and I'll print out a like white PLA. Make it look all pretty. Let's do it. Uh, fucking shitty titties. I'm fucking trash, dude. I'm fucking human trash. All right, final impressions. This is the uh, bow pedal version two. I <laughs> fucking, what am I looking at here? Beep. Okay, as you can tell, the first one, I fucked up the logo. Fix that, right? Everything's good now. Uh, differences two. Concave is greater. This is two mil. This is one mil. Uh, pins. These are fat boys. The skinny boys. This is literally four. I think these are 3.5 and they are 3.25 millimeter tall. These are like four fours with a five degree uh, taper. So changed all that. Obviously size of the holes thicker. This is five mil. This is six mil uh, on the tops. 10 mil centerpiece. Maybe I should have done that a little bit bigger. If I change anything, it would make that maybe 14 mil from side to side. Uh, both have the diamond plate. This one is designed for if you're not going to use the bearings, like if you just want to stick the spindle in there, tighten a nut on, ride it. Then this one is obviously, I made it for the bearings and assembled it and put it all together. It's crazy that even that back rubber uh, protective, you know, make sure shit doesn't get on your bearings, fits in there. That was just dumb luck. I built a pedal cap. Tolerances were a little off, so I did 15.5 uh, diameter. I probably should have done like 15.75, make it a little snug. So I just shoved it in there threw some crazy glue on it. I mean, it's DIY anyway, so what does it matter? It's just to protect, you know, grease and shit from getting in there. And anyways, dropping it on this edge, it's kind of better that it's in there so it won't get all smashed up. Uh, I mean, I suppose I could make like a notch edge like normal plastic pedals have, but do I really care that much about a pedal cap? The answer is no, I don't give a shit. Glue it in there, do whatever. Don't put it on, I don't care. I just printed that out with some white PLA to give it some nice contrast, but this is crazy. I'm really happy. Like, that's fucking sick. I don't care what anyone says, I don't care whoever the fuck is mad. This, being able to do this in your house, learning how to do this, with nothing more, I learned how to do this with nothing more than fucking Google and YouTube. Learned how to do CAD, create the files. Now I'm going to put them on the internet. I'm going to release this bow pedal online for people to make, ride, do that shit wherever they may be. Boom. <coughs> Alright. Well, now I'm going to take all this time. And I'm going to edit myself a YouTube's video and I'm going to put it online just so people have something to watch and be like, he's crazy. Oh my God. <laughs> All right. Woo!